Okay, Christian in five, four, okay, we're three, all coming two, Christian. one, go. Well, it would help if I had window focus, but there we go. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome to this Group A match. This is Christian's side of his match against Nervly. Yeah, I'll probably what I'll do is, I'll, when I edit it, I'm going to like keep on switching back between the commentary or something. That's going to be, that's gonna be like impossible to watch. Because I'm recording like the game sound, but also oh, the Discord at the same time. Because it's just recording the Windows whole thing. But I can like just go for the game if you want. Um, no, no, yeah, recording the call is good, of course. Yeah. Um, right. Yeah, so this is like 100% artisans except for Sunny Flight, basically. Like, all the levels include the home world, but not Sunny Flight. And, uh... What, did he have the Spick accent? No, we already discussed this. He had like just. A generic American accent. All oh, right, speak accent. Yeah, so a, a generic American accent. Yeah, the speak accent. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that is well. That is what it's come down to. <laughs> so how much? How much They're percent? Taking over. How much percent of the U.S. is white, Christian? Again? Uh, not enough. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's, so I think officially it's like fifty-six percent. But if you actually um not consider every Mario what? Fernandez as white, then it's uh, more like 20 or something. <laughs> yeah, that's Mario like... Fernandez, so it's like a cross between an Italian and a Hispanic person. Or Mario Fernandez. <laughs> more like Carlos. <laughs> Carlos. Sanchez. Carlos Sanchez. Sanchez Fernandez. <laughs> How's it? Okay, just, uh, just as a disclaimer, we are. N this is not a racist podcast or anything. Yeah. This is not a white supremacy circle jerk. It's just. It's just Christian expressing his views, and we tolerate everyone's views. I thought you were going to say it's stay just with Christians. Then I was like, what? We are not against blacks. It's just Christian. That oh, I'll have to do that. That thing them. that uh, Ted Price did uh, on the Insomniac YouTube channel, where he, like just tells everybody how absolutely not racist he is, by the way. <laughs> What's he done? Uh, he made that, that video would've... on the Insomniac YouTube channel saying, by the way, um, I'd like, like everyone to know that Insomniac is inclusive and we're diverse. And uh, <laughs> just in case right, anything what, comes out... What happened that he felt the need to do that? Uh, Trump did, I guess. I'm, I'm sure there's some dirt on him and uh, he just... God to... damn it, Trump. No, it sounds more like... You know, it's sort of piggybacking, piggybacking on the sort of just media attention of like, yeah, we don't like Trump either. And by the way, in this country, it like it's now a thing that we need to fucking just, you know, uh, promote everywhere and like, you know, suck our own dicks about the fact that we're inclusive and we don't hate minorities because supposedly, at, like, all the meanies in America do. <laughs> We have to all like remind each other that we're the ones that don't like minorities because, you know, they are very easy to hate. Well, welcome to reminding ourselves that we are not the problem. <laughs> what, what, is that, what is that supposed to mean, Wally? Wally? <laughs> uh, who, who is the problem, Wally? Come on, spit it out. Uh, Trump. There you go. 921, which is like... 30 minutes later than it does in um, like the UK. But I guess like, I think what probably should happen is that either the Netherlands is in the on the UK time or UK is on Netherlands time because um, I, it really doesn't fucking matter. But um, it's just something interesting that I was looking at. Yeah, I actually never thought the, the, the possibility of even like, I mean, even if it's like the same the same time zone, uh, like the sun still sets at different times. I mean, it makes sense because yeah, exactly, yeah. Well, yeah, the the sun always sets um, earlier than the UK because because um, you're on the uh, equator, so you have like not as long days, basically. No. Oh my yeah. god, I'm missing one fucking, one fucking gem in Dark Hollow. Um, <laughs> His wife is a, like a comedy hole, but then right, yeah. are, so. Well, I think, no, I think you're just overgeneralizing right now. Christian, stop it. 
<laughs> what the hell was that voice? voice? It's a whole voice. No. I think, no, 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 we all need to be nice to each other. Well, oh, yeah. I, I fucked it. <laughs> One Thank you being nice college. to each other. Who? Bill Burr's wife? <laughs> Are you referring to her as it because she's black? That's too much. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 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 fucking Andrew sounds like, a Ratchet sounds like a fucking... Uh, a, an 80 year old Japanese woman now or something. <laughs> like, <laughs> she has a she has a big smile. Ara, ara. Big Burr's uh, big Burr's wife has a big smile. Big Burr, <laughs> big Burr, <laughs> Bird Bigly. Right, well I've, I've already lost this fucking thing because I'm still on Dark Hollow with looking for one bloody gem. I'm pretty sure he was. Dumpy is so negative. Nobody had that problem too with Stonehill though. Oh, there yeah. we go. Finally. Fa Finally, how fucking. I mean, fuck how this is called. Stone, stone, stone Valley. Stone Valley. No. <laughs> so I can remember. Yeah, it's, it's the one with the um, the the old man with the cane, and the the, the, <laughs> the old man with a cane. <laughs> the shepherd. That's it. I saw some coins over here, James Plant. Go fast. Although I got out of the home world with like four gems left at 96. I was like, fuck, where are they? Just screw it, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for levels. <laughs> I'll have to look for the final later. Yeah, good luck, Christian, by the way. <laughs> oh, good luck, Christian, yes. <laughs> His wife looks like fucking uh, Ella Fitzgerald or some shit with a huge face. His wife looks like a gorilla. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. I mean, probably. I mean, no. What are you talking about? What a racist comparison. God. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Okay, so she happens to be black, and she happens to look kind of gorilla-ish. It's got nothing to do with one another, okay? <laughs> there is no correlation between these two things. No. Like, you can say that a white person looks like a gorilla, so... Let's be all-inclusive, right? Um, I mean, she had a hell of a fucking voice on her, so... I, I love that. Uh, L. Gerald. L. Fitzgerald. Who's what? Who's Ibn Sina? Who's that? Sounds sounds like some what? fucking name that Fraser would pick. Because um, <laughs> on Google apparently we're celebrating his a thousand and thirty eighth birthday today. Wait, what? <laughs> um, I actually thought you were talking about some fucking meme guy's name that said Ibn uh, Sina, like what? it's like <laughs> like John Cena, but like Ibn. Of it. No, this guy, this guy, um, I I Ibn Cena. <laughs> okay. Oh, he's, he's the original. He's like the the great 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 great, etc. Grandfather of uh, John Cena. He's the original Cena. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. nice. The original Cena. What's no. a what's a <laughs> bully man? What's a bully <laughs> mong? Oh, okay, so it's just, you know, a lot of stuff. Okay, fair enough. Oh, I was asking about Polymath. That's what she said. Oh, he was a, he was the one of the most significant physicians, astronomers, thinkers, and writers of the Islamic Golden Age. Bet you didn't know that, Chris. Oh, Islamic <laughs> Golden Age. Oxymoron, if I've ever heard one. So, um, the Islamic Golden Age is an era of the history of Islam traditionally dated from the 8th century to the 14th century. Hmm, that's everyone else's Dark Age. What a coincidence. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it makes you think. <laughs> oh, everybody's having a Dark Age. Okay, this is our Golden Age. Worse for me. Well, maybe they made us have a Dark Age. Ooh, the plot thickens. There is Lom fucked everything up. If you want a real dark age, just go to Detroit. 
I was actually, yeah, because I was looking at fucking Ella Fitzgerald's picture and I was like, gonna do like a Sheep. black joke about the Dark Age, but I was like, you know what? Christian. Mastrofra. If you like. Ugh, sorry. If you could go anywhere on a like vacation or something in the world, where would you go? Oh shit, so many places. Like, I'm a sucker for nature, so I'd, I'd honestly go for New Zealand, Greenland, Iceland, uh, Norway. There's, there's are like my most favorite places, I guess, when it comes to I think nature. like Iceland would be really interesting, freaking like, especially in the middle of summer oh, or in yeah. the middle of winter. Just like, what it'd be like to be like, have 24 hours of like, well actually no, I don't think Iceland has like, it, it isn't that bad, you don't have like, all winter or full summer. Let me have a look. Sunset Iceland. Let's see what I mean obviously it's gonna stay really late, but yeah, it sets at like 10 11. Whoa. Which isn't <laughs> too bad I guess. Yeah here in Portugal it mostly goes like 10 p.m. 9 is when the sun goes down in the summer. No, yeah, like he was always a Baron's IRL friend, right? So it was obvious that he was just gonna dip in to try one fucking match out and then find out that it wasn't really his cup of tea. Yeah, pretty much. I, I don't know, he said that he had like family issues. Pretty or much. It is like every fucking, every contestant that sort of. Weird. I don't know. <laughs> Every contestant that's like, you know, sort of getting to know the scene, like, is sort of, oh, there's like a first time, this is like their, uh, uh, I don't know the fucking English word for it, their, uh, Kenneth marking, their, their fucking thing of like, okay, you can now, in their introduction to speedrunning, yeah. and like, you can sort of get them into it, and like, it's always completely wasted. Right. It's either you get into it or you don't get into it. Well, see, that's how I, what I feel like is the lazy attitude that's kept speedrunning a fringe sport, and I think we can bring it to the masses a with a with a, a less defeatist attitude. A Jordan fringe. I think we can make speedrunning palatable and interesting to everyone. All we need to do is dumb it down. Well, well dumb it down, how so? Um. Play, try speed running interactive movies. <laughs> AKA every fucking modern game. Okay, can I kill myself now? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, in the game or IRL? Both! <laughs> yeah, so jo Johnny, what's your, what's your opinion on like um, movie games, like stories in games? Do you think uh, stories belong in video games? Uh, sure, a plot is fine, yeah. Do you think a game should be based entirely off a story? Like, and it's just like an interactive story? Do you think that's... No! Why that's is that? That's not a game. What is that, then? It's an interactive movie. It's a choose-your-own-adventure. What's the difference, though? The difference is that you're not really playing a game. You're just, like, choosing between different pre-scripted sequences that's to see what play plays out. Svalbard, which is like this, um... This island above uh, Finland by like probably like a couple hundred kilometers, and uh, I think it's like the no, most the, the most northern um, uh, inhabited place on Earth. I think uh, I think it's technically part of Norway or something. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool to go here. Yeah. No, fuck. <laughs> Their major city is called. Long year buying. Long, Long year been. <laughs> Long year been. <laughs> yeah, I've never heard of that. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> what uh, what level are you on now? Uh, town Square. I've choked <laughs> so much. It's not even funny. I'm I'm pretty sure I've already lost. Like he would have. Are you just admitting to your? Uh... Uh, Autoerotic asphyxiation addiction. <laughs> I've already lost. I've choked. So. 
I chose so many times, I've just lost. Check so many times I fucking came. Yeah. That's most of the time. And a lot of the time, I'm trying to, like, I'm having a conversation in Portuguese or something with someone. And then I'm like, okay, how, how do you say this word in Portuguese? Because I can remember it in English, and I keep thinking of the word, of the English word. But then I'm like, how the hell do you say this in <laughs> Portuguese? Because I've got so used to speaking English all the time. It's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of stupid. Do you, do you speak yeah. English to people, like, um, in Portugal? Often? Oh, yeah. Um, like, I, I, 90% of my sentences have at least one English word. Because sometimes I mix, I mix both right, languages a lot. Um, and when I'm, like, with my best friend or something, we always speak English all the time. I, I don't think, I don't think I've actually heard a Portuguese word come out of this. Well, I have, but that was when we were in school. But other than that... What, what is the thing that they put it inside? What's it called? Frigondel. What's that? It's uh, basically a phallic-shaped bit of awful meat. Right. Okay. I think so I showed it to you before. Is it all... No, you... it's not my penis. No, it wasn't, it wasn't, like, it wasn't the thing that we were going to buy from that fast food place right near... Yeah, yeah, right. it was. Or it was that thing. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah. Oh. Is it, is, I guess it's pretty unhealthy, because it's, like, fried or something, right? Yes. It's yeah. Quite, quite this is a really disgusting-looking one that I... Oh, looks yeah. very plasticky. I'll pop it inside the video, I guess. <laughs> Should I put? Should I put in Donnie's food right now? Actually, it probably the one that I when it actually doesn't look so plastic, it probably looks worse. It's like a really oh, disgusting. Oh, yeah, that's gross. It's just some some like some open festering wound. It looks it's like like a, or something. like a trough. Close <laughs> <laughs> your eyes. Yeah, like for pigs or something, right? Is it as bad as um like a kebab? You know, like. The slab, 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 some more. Uh, <laughs> <what? laughs> oh, Fuck you that, Were you in that call with the kebab that made me turn purple? I don't think you were. No, no. Oh, okay. you... What's that? Is purple another? Is purple? Uh, if is it like? <laughs> is that used for any political fucking affiliation? Actually, you kept it, it turned him into you kept. Yeah. <laughs> Which is. From where most people learn English, like I learned most of uh, most of the language through oh, right, playing right, Runescape yep. when I was four years old or something. Oh shit! Um, and from there on, ah, dog. And from there on, yeah, it was just kind of. Uh, yeah, a uh, I know Johnny Natrium. Um, no, don't. He he learned it through just like media, basically. Yeah. Yeah, because I started having like uh, extra um, curriculum classes, if that's the word, uh, in second grade, and they were English classes. But by then, I already knew kind of a lot. I and I don't say this like trying to brag or anything, because I, I hate how it always sounds like that. But um, it was always to the, to a point where I I got like a diplom, uh, not a diplom, is that a word? Um, like certificates of a uh, best student uh, in the class oh my god dogs um so yeah i guess i was fortunate to be exposed to to a lot of to, to that kind of media that helped me with english a lot and then not only that but um i also always had a shit ton of friends from like that i met online and i would speak to them a lot through either <laughs> text oh my god i died no! What level are you in? No. No. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm turning yeah. toasty. Trouble with the doggos. Huh? Yes, the fucking doggos. Rick Flair wrestling. Now, enunciator. Uh, I don't think I've ever heard that. I don't know if that's a word. I mean, that should be a word. It should be, I guess. It's like just. If enunciate is a word, then that should be as well. Yeah. Uh, what level are you in now, Christian? Uh, Stonehill. Uh, about to finish it, I think. And then it's just like mopping up the uh, hub world. 
how do you think they're going to ruin um... England further? <laughs> Sent more immigrants this way. I was going to say Sparrow reignited. But... How are they going to fuck it up? Um, it's probably like Sparks like doesn't click they already? half the time. <gasps> Spire 1 is going to be in the thing yeah, and Spire 2 and 3 have to be downloaded. <laughs> um, I'm kind of like, why did you do that? Because it'd be kind of cool to have it kind of like Crash did it. Um, but I mean, I don't know. It's kind of, if, if there's someone that doesn't have access to the internet and they can't play the... Oh my god, I died again. I want to kill myself. I would love it um, if the th second and third games are just literal shite. It's just like, it's all running over your screen and everything. Well, they have they have a month and two weeks now. Yeah, that's not long enough. <laughs> it's what, not you don't the think disc. they started? <laughs> to start it, yeah. Yeah, well, it's to start Spyro 3 from what we've seen. They apparently just started, really. Really? <laughs> have you, uh, have you pre-ordered it, Wally? No. Oh. <laughs> no. Why would I? <laughs> okay, yeah. I've, I've finished. One, I don't have an Xbox One or PS4. Well, that I mean, we, that was not really, it's, yeah, we don't know who the fuck won, so, um. Oh, well, 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 I'm pretty sure I didn't win. But congratulations, anyway, to, yeah. uh, to whomever. Uh, nervly. And uh... congratulations to Christian. Congratulations, Nervly. We might be seeing another group A match from Christian. The uh, yeah. the, the real losers are the people that watched all through this fucking video. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's not many of them, at least. So, all right. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Don't don't beat yourself up like that. You'll never draw in more. <laughs>
Because you can't make money IRL, you have to make <laughs> it in the train game. <laughs> I'm making all the dough. This is how you do it. This is how you, uh, this is how you make money in the real world. What are they? Simoleons? Simoleons? <laughs> Actually, I think it's pounds? Yeah, it is. It's in pounds. I think you can change it to be whatever you want, though. <laughs> pounds. Maybe we should change it to... What currency do you identify as? I mean, the pound shouldn't even exist. It should just be the euro, really. Like, I reckon they, they should just oh, use the no. euro. Now so, they're going to um, adopt the euro now that they're leaving the fucking EU. Yeah, well, yeah, I know. See, that's like, you know, like they're leaving the EU, but then they can like make a pack. That's what Theresa made. That's what the deal should be. It should be that we leave the EU, but, we, but they take the euro. That's what the deal. We. <laughs> we. <laughs> you know, like, you know, you know, the UK, you know, we, us, you know. No, but just, just, just going to take the euro for himself. I'm gonna take I think you're not doing a good enough job at speaking with an English accent if you're, uh, if you want to be English. I mean, that. the Australian accent is basically just a southeastern English accent. Okay. All right. Like you could, well, you could confuse my accent with uh, dancers and Christian. Not really. No. 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 Open TTD. What, what, what is it? What is it? Do? It's a train game. You, you built. You, you oh my it. god. It's so cool. <laughs> Have you ever played Roller Coaster Tycoon? Yes. Yeah, it's like that, except with trains. So how yeah. much does it cost? It's free. So if you are, you si are you seriously yeah. having a Tinder date over no, to just, watch you play you just over download, TTD? Just download it on, um, uh, like, it's open source, you just download it. Just type in open TTD and you'll find it. Oh, okay, I will too. No problems. <laughs> you're always coming down Thanks. here and talking to people. Like, I've been silent for the past couple of hours. You're always, you're always talking to people. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hang on, sorry. She oh. sounds like eight years old. No, I, well, knowing Andrew. No guess, comment. You, you know the whole pattern with psychopaths? They start off sort of, you know, on the edge doing sort of, you know, bad shit and all, like sort of just killing animals, torturing animals, but they sort of meet more and more. So <clears throat> while we haven't been paying attention, he's gone from 15-year-olds to 8-year-olds. There's grass on the green, play cricket. I guess it rhyme. Right, okay. I uh, just got the three dragons to get at Town Square. Or however nice. many there are, and then I'll be done. Oh, nice. Coast my way into round two. You must have started them bloody before most of us came in. I mean, to be fair, it's just a run to get all the dragons in Austin, so it's, it doesn't take too long anyway. Yeah, that's true, yeah, yeah. It doesn't take too long. Now I'll be out the, uh, I'll be the freeway uh, race. Sorted. Hmm. That's going to be a nightmare to arrange. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm back, Seas. Mm. I thought... I thought that was that fucking nerd female to male. Fucking... Oh, he fucking deafened himself. Fine. He's clearly not back. <laughs> the freak, I'm he's fat, the freak of your imagination. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, for fuck. Uh huh. Well, yeah, right, right, right. five. Hello. Who was who was recording the round two draw ratchet? Who was recording it? My friend. Yeah. Who was? Her name, her name is Sophie. This is not the fucking, this is not the, <clears throat> the deviant art with this. No, that's with, not With her first sonar. I haven't, I haven't right. met that person. I haven't met that person. I actually thought you'd like, got it, uh, coming over and watching you okay, I'm play open TTD while some fucking <laughs> speed runs down. Christian's done, everyone. <laughs> Wait, you're done? Oh, yeah, okay. Well, that is a short Sweet. rate. I'll see you in round two. Well, I mean, you have to race him first before that happens. Let me just double check. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I've got so, all the uh, dragons. There we go. So, 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 Sedanta, where, where, when do you want to race? Samantha. Um, probably when everything's confirmed that, like, about the round two, because this could potentially go into a triple threat. Yeah, yes, that's Johnny. Yeah. Danta, Samantha. We need to work that out. <laughs> so, Nobly's going to come on. He's going to do Luke's run and he's going to do Christian's re rematch. And uh, yeah, so Christian, just send me a video ASAP so that I can know exactly what's happening. Yeah, oh, uh, well, I'm going to stop recording now. I, it, 
if it even goes into a video. So, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, 